What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's Reclusive Gamer, and I'm checking out Enderall again. I have no idea why I'm playing this game, but checked out a couple of videos on YouTube on some reviews, and I got a bit nostalgic, I guess. Uh, a little bored of playing Skyrim. So, well, not really bored, bored in terms of uh, the visuals and the graphics. are just amazing. There's so many different mod lists and so many mods you can add onto Skyrim that... And, uh, from a visual perspective, it doesn't get boring, but gameplay-wise, and some of the quests and stuff and things like that gets a little, I don't know, redundant, I suppose. So I needed something a little different, and I decided to jump back into Enderall. I have a, I had, or have a backup list, two of them actually. I have the original Enderall VR backup list, and this is the latest one that I download, but it's mixed in with Somnium, so the visuals look great it's an overall of the original one and yeah this is the first time i played it in a long time months maybe a year i don't know but more importantly this is the first time i'm playing enderall on the rtx 4090 so i was also a bit curious about the performance to see how it would function and so far wow it's super smooth very very smooth so all right, so without further ado, here we go. Uh, I'm going to venture out into the unknown and see how far I can get until the game crashes. <laughs> Hopefully it won't crash. Wow. Very nice. Oh, look. Oh, wow. They're little piglets. Come here, piggy. <clears throat> I wonder if I can grab it. Oh, I can grab it. Oh, it has an anus. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I'm a sick bastard. I can grab it, but it's like stuck into the ground for some reason. All right, this kid is like spazzing out. Did you look at the shrine yet? The hell? This kid looks weird. Pig pocket. Did you look like at the pickpocket. shrine yet? Did right, you look at him. the shrine yet? What shrine? Did you look at the shrine yet? Did oh. you look at the shrine yet? Uh, okay. That's all he says. Oh, here's Mama Pig. Oh, I can grab it. Yo, this is wild. I can't believe I can grab objects like this. Like, animals this thing is freaking adorable hey he's a cute little pig all right go ahead go on yeah the game looks great i don't know if it looks as good as skyrim well, it depends on the mod list i have two three three different mod lists so far Okay, the pop-ins with the grass is a little strange. Um, I have Mad Gods Overhaul, the VR mod list. And I have a new one that I haven't showcased yet. I think it's called Panda's Summon Guard, I believe. Maybe I did showcase it. I can't remember. I played so many different mod lists that I, I really can't keep up. But that one looks very good. Very. I mean, both of them look good. Mad Gods and Panda's Summon Guard. Probably two of the best looking mod lists I've ever seen. Uh, I think Hitmancy had one as well. His was pretty good too. But uh, yeah, the, the last two that i mentioned um they have like hundreds if not thousands of mods and i'm a little apprehensive a little scared to mess around with them too too much i did add some mods but not too many um i might play that next and i think the third one that i have on my nvme drive is Novus ascension but that is flat screen that i'll definitely play sometime this week and that is just that is like one of the best mod lists i've ever seen flat screen it just it completely blows my mind on how beautiful it looks so i'm gonna turn the music down that's a little too loud and i'm like screaming i'm a little uh worried about the music situation because i've been i've been getting copyrighted for some strange reason there's a there is a scammer on youtube by the way he goes around i forgot his name Lat latin author author latino author i forgot his name i'll i'll show his page i found out who this guy is and what he looks like this guy's a real uh, piece of work he goes around uh copyright claiming 
people's videos, uh, mostly smaller content creators. He wouldn't dare do it to a big creator because he knows he can't get away with it. So he likes to pick on, you know, smaller YouTubers such as myself. And uh, I've been waiting like maybe two weeks now. He won't let up. I, I pretty much refuted or disputed it. And what happens on the YouTube system is if you put in a dispute, if 29 to 30 days, basically a, if a month passes and the person doesn't try to refute or dispute your dispute, you automatically win. And whatever money that's acquired through your video goes back to you. So right now it's an escrow. So the, yeah, this scumbag won't let up, man. Real piece of shit. And I, yeah, I, I found, I found out who he is. Like I said, he's been doing this to other content creators and there's a video, two different videos that I uh, found out about him and uh, lots and lots of people are complaining. Uh, you should check out the comment section. He's been doing this for a while. I don't know how he gets away with it. And what pisses me off about it is YouTube's not doing anything about it. So there's something off about it. The whole situation. I don't know why YouTube is just letting this person slide. They're not demonetizing or penalizing this guy in any way. They're not banning him. You know, it, it's crazy. But yet a video of mine, if if I put in a couple of memes, whatever that offends YouTube, you know, I'll get demonetized like with, you know, with the quickness, which is, which is crazy. It's unbelievable. Or for a stupid thumbnail. So I don't know. It's just, yeah, we live in clown world, man. You know, the, the shenanigans that happens on this platform is, is very questionable. Anyways. All right. Let me just continue playing. I don't want to just spend the whole time just complaining like I usually do. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll do a couple of quests. See what happens. Oh, wow. The water effects. Okay. There's dirt and blood in this. The water effects is pretty cool. The water looks beautiful. There's like reflections as well. Uh, this particular mod list performs very well, by the way. Even on a my other computer that I use, the 1080 Ti, it was the performance was pretty damn good. So yeah, with the 4090, obviously no problems. So hopefully I won't get any crashes. All right, I let me figure out what to do. I think there's a lockbox here, and there's nothing in there. Okay, where is the ah uh, quest? Quest. Here we go. Okay, secrets from the can. Find the place described by the poem. Yeah, this is it right here. But the thing is not showing up. Alright, rescue Alfred from the Three River Watch. Read all volumes. Uh, the Void. What is this? Find the Strong Box. Alright, you know, I'm going to try that. But I believe the last time I tried that, I couldn't find the, uh, the thing that you want. Okay, here it is. Wait. Where am I? No. Okay, here's a strong box. Alright, I'll... You know what? Let, let me talk to this guy, actually. I'll talk to him first. Talk with Yarrow's childhood friend, Alfred. I have to turn around. I think... Where is he? Okay. Yeah, I have pretty much every HUD element turned off. There's the arrow there. He's somewhere up in this direction. I think I know where he is. There's a bar. There it is up there. Did you look at Shut the up. Yet? No. Fuck off. No, he might be either up there. No, he's up in this direction. Yeah, this game is is pretty massive. And it's very confusing, to be honest with you. I never really understood how to play this game. So, if anybody could be so kind as to lead me in the right direction. Any tips and tricks would definitely help. Here's a bar. You know, let me check out and see the inside of this place. Make sure it works. If it doesn't crash because I think it, mm -hmm. could, it crashed the last time. But no, it's not crashing. Oh wow, their uh, their outfits are different. Uh, well, that's just how we always. A game. Come on, 
Take a seat. Count all the more. And she did just got her new delivery of ale. It's kind of dark in here. A game. Come on. Take a seat. The light rays. I haven't seen that in a while. Wow, the character models are pretty good. <sighs> Very nice. Cool outfit. Yeah, the facial textures are very nice. Very pretty. Very nice. Evening. Can I help you? Okay. Alright, that signifies that I've read this particular document or book already. Who is this? Gusha? I, yeah, I can't pronounce that. Hey, aren't you? Stay where you are! Born from malice, evil. Huh? Can I help you? My sir, a foreigner, huh? What a surprise. He sacrificed his life Wait a minute, that looks like Nazim. Nazim, what are you doing here? Ishan. Hello, who might you be? I'm no one of consequence, but you're the stranger here. Alright, my you voice first. recognition, the dragon speak mod works, is working. Um... My name is Endril Somnium. Would you? No, 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 no. I don't want you to join me. You don't look like you're from around here. You don't look like you're from around here. You're correct. I was born and raised in Cairo. Cairo has been my home for many years now. All right. <sighs> Another exhausted soul. What do you need? I want something to drink. What have you got? Oh, a bit of this and that. The roast rabbit is really good. Take a look for yourself. Pe Damn. I only have 49 pennies? Yeah, I heard this game is one of the things that's difficult is the economy system that uh, you basically have to fight for every penny that you earn in this game. It's not a lot, and anything that you do earn, you basically have to buy skill points or books and things like that. It's, I, it's, this is not an easy game. By no stretch of the imagination, I heard. Beef, that's a lot. Twelve. Twelve pennies. Now you, I'm going to be starving Safe in this game. Travels. Hello. Hello. Uh. They don't react. Yes, the oh, well. they don't they don't really react like uh, hmm? in Skyrim. Is it important? I forgot the name of it. More NPC reactions or something. Oh, I don't. So hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change the controls. So whatever I'm pointing my controller is where he or my character kind of walks in a way it's good because I can look around I can turn left and right great for like cinematic shots cinematic b-roll shots but when playing it's not it's not so good especially if I have to use my left hand for anything uh, this person is not talking How you doing, huh? How you doing? Do you come here often? Huh? Do you, did you come here often? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, 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 no. Okay. So much for that. <laughs> uh, all right. Let me reload it. <laughs> all right. Now I know not to do that again. All right, you know what? Let me just look. <laughs> Let me just look for that dude. Whatever his name is. 
No, fuck Did off, kid. No, oh, yeah, that, 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 that. All right, not going to that bar. Where is this fucking dude? Oh wow! Oh, I got some. Uh, I got. I got some XP. I think he is here somewhere. Is this him? Maybe. This is him, Alfred. Okay. Um. Uh, who are you? Just a traveler. You are Alfred, right? The childhood friend of a man named Yarrow. Just a traveler. You are Alfred, right? The childhood friend of a man named Yarrow. Okay, sometimes the lines don't work. Uh, Yarrow, I... Uh, this is about his death, isn't it? Uh, the rampage. You've heard about it? Of course, who hasn't? Yes, yeah, some lines work, some lines don't. one of us, after all. It is terrible. Nice. Simply terrible. Uh, you want to hear an old man's opinion, though? I I always expected Not that really, but something like this I know would I, have, I have to in order to advance the story, Malthus, so. forgive me for talking about a keeper like that, but it's the truth. Exactly. You mean you saw it coming? How? Hard to explain, really. Come on, uh, let's find somewhere to sit. Oh, uh, it'll be easier to talk that way. Wait, do I have to sit? Can I just talk? Alright, I guess I'll sit. Uh, Alright. Uh, uh, now I gotta face him. Well, yellow. Yellow. That's quite a subject, you know. You were right when you said we were best friends. Our fathers knew each other. For as long as I can remember, Yarrow and I were getting into trouble together. At least, until his mother died. Not of old age, I assume? No. Bandits killed her in broad daylight on, on Penny Road. Today, these incidents are common, but not back then. The road was considered safe. Very safe. It's, she was on her way weird. to Park, accompanied by three other women, and they were set upon at the pass. None of them survived. Yarrow was shattered. I think the worst part was how his father went downhill after his wife's death. The fishery decayed. And the poor guy filled his days with boozing and sleeping. All right. It changed hey, me too. forever. How exactly? Well, that's a good question. On the one hand, he became a man, despite his tender age. On the other hand, something inside him woke up, so to speak. A desire to make more of his life. Old Mother Jenica noticed it and took him under her wing. He learned how to read and write, and soon he knew all the holy verses by heart. When he didn't have to help his drunken father, he helped in the village as much as he could. He transformed his grief into productivity. Sounds like a rather positive development. Indeed, that's one way to look at it. It wasn't long before he was the, the jewel of the village. The striving young fisherman destined for great things, even though he was only on the path of a manufacturer. And then the inevitable happened. A yeah, keeper Jesus. of the order Music came to Riverville loud. to see the prodigy with his own eyes. And behold, in addition to Yarrow's ingenuity, he also had a slumbering magical talent. The keeper took him away, and a few months later, he started his novitiate. Since then, I've only seen him once or twice, as he rarely visited Riverville. I, I don't think he ever noticed how much that hurt me. I think this one advances it. Um, Alright, let me do this one first. 
Is it that uncommon for someone on the manufacturer's path to get a chance to become a keeper? <laughs> if one of the manufacturers makes it to Sergeant of the Guard, it's reason enough for a bard song. He must have been the first novice in centuries who was not of the sublime path. So yes, sir, it is uncommon. More than that. So what did you mean by I always suspected that something like this would happen? So what did you mean by I always suspected that something like this would happen? Okay, that line's not working. Had to manually oh, select it's it. hard to explain. I believe it was the way he was talking about his grand plans. How he wanted to make the world a better place to become the greatest keeper since Lorem Waterblade. Underneath all this, there was a... there was an anger. I'm gonna have to lower this music. An anger mixed okay. with deep grief and disappointment. Uh, I don't think he was aware of it because he drew all his strength from that anger. The strength to do all this, to, to learn and to work day and night, but it frightened me like the Blue Death. It slumbers inside the pathless mage who believes he can master magic without the order. He sounds help. like the David Goggins of Enderal. At first, <laughs> it grants power, but then one day it bursts out in an unholy wave of destruction, turning him into one of the monsters in the old songs. Um, anyway, I'm just an old man. What do I know about these uh, matters? Pretty old too. Now let me go to sleep. All these memories are making me weary. All right. Thanks for your help. Yes, of course. All right. Completed talk with Yarrow's childhood friend Alfred. Tell Jesper about Alfred's stories. All right. Uh, where is Jesper? Jesper, Jesper. Wait a minute. Where's my quest? Wait, where the hell am I? Okay, apparently I was there already. Sea View Lodge. Okay, I am right here. Or okay, here's River River. What is that? Riverville. Yeah, this place is pretty freaking big, man. Oh, there's another area here, too. It's like some kind of castle complex of some kind. Yeah, this place just looks pretty... Looks pretty sizable. Oh, there's another freaking area? Holy shit. Alright, um... Where is that Jasper dude? Uh, wait, what do I do? Nope, 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 nope. Okay, quest. Alright, I don't care about this. Alright, here we go. The void. Let me just concentrate on the void. And while I'm at it, let me check out the mod configuration. Conduit, dirt and blood. Settings, hmm. Soap required. Soap is required for baths. Nah, who needs soap? NPCs bathe. Yeah. All right. Why not? Swimming is as effective as bathing. Okay. Didn't, wait, is Dindalod working? Beautiful. It's working. It says, it says Enderol. Skip videos? No, I'll leave that alone. Alright, okay. I think that's just the economy. Enhanced blood. Uh, I'll leave that alone. Immersive smithing. Oh, wow. This has immersive smithing. That's cool. MCM recorder. I don't really don't even know what that is. More HUD VR. Let me see this. Alright, I'll leave that. 
brass. Okay, I know what this is. This is the effects. On screen effects when it rains. Full. Raining. I'll put that on full or heavy. Miscellaneous configuration book. Alright, archery, sky UI. Yeah, I'm not gonna mess with that. Spell wheel. Resets. Favorite spells only. No wrist huds. Hmm. You know, I'll leave that on for now. General. Types. Yeah, show torches on my secondary hand. Uh... Favorite melee. Favorite shield. Favorite spells. Okay, I think that's about it. Um, favorite bow. Okay, bow. Okay, I use my left hand for the bow. Alright, yeah, favorite bows for the left hand. And crossbows I usually put on my right shoulder, so. Staves. Okay. Let me go to the right hand now. Uh, favorite crossbows. There we go. And favorite powers. Uh, I'll leave that be. All right. I'll just have favorite spells in general on my right hand and left hand. Okay, melee. Favorite melee. I am a righty. Uh, arrows. I'll leave that be. Um. You know what? Yeah, favorite food and potions. Because in case when I have to... Can't use magic too much because then you get some kind of weird sickness in this game. That the devs made this hard. I think there's some kind of weird potion called Ambrosia that you have to consume to get rid of the sickness that overusing magic will cause to your... NPC, your main protagonist, uh, to his body. So, and I heard those potions are hard to come by, or at least the ingredients are. And they kind of, it depends, like, each time you play, I heard they change the ingredients around. So, yeah, the devs pretty much made, they went out of their way to make this game as difficult as possible. Alright, so I'll put the favorite potions and foods on my right hand. So, as, just in case when I'm running away with my, I have to use the left stick to run. I can just kind of use a spell wheel and grab a potion and place it near near my headset or my mouth to consume it. All right, that's good enough. Storm lightning. I usually have it on ultra realistic. And of course there's Rick. I don't like to play around with this too much weeks all right that's it let me save it all right i'm long-winded i deeply apologize for that all right who is this wait a second Whoa. you seem blazers stay where you are i don't know who you think you are Whoa. but no one breaks the law and gets away with it what did I there do? are two ways we can do this you either pay a fine now or you go straight to jail and believe me i'm serious What did I do? Oh, man. Good oh. idea. Now give me that weapon and come with me. What weapon? Oh, hell no. No, 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 no. I don't like this. Nope, nope, nope. Did I say? Okay. Let me reload this. Fuck that. All right, I, that's what I get for trying to talk to every single NPC. Let me just go and avoid this prick. Oh, okay, this is Alfred's house. Yes. Yes. What you cooking? 
It's a uh, static smoking stew. And what is this? The golden house. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, why is everybody trying to attack me? Okay, let me get out of here, man. What the f... Oh, dude, you know what? Yo. NPCs are very unpredictable in this game. I don't know if I'm gonna play this, man. This fucking dude just started attacking me for no reason. Alright, let me just select the quest. Alright, let me look at the map. Alright, here... Alright, there's a strong box. And... Where... Alright, this prick is somewhere in here. Near the strong box, actually. You know what, let me just... Fast... I, th I hope I can fast travel. Yes. Beach house. Alright, he's gotta be somewhere in there. But let me find that thing. There's a strong box here somewhere. Alright, it is not showing. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. Showing in the compass. Holy shit, that's a big-ass crab. Okay. It's gotta be somewhere around here. I remember the last time... One of the last times I played this, is it in the water? Oh, I've just passed it. Where is it? There it is. Okay, why can't I go underwater? Alright. I think I know why. Settings. Realistic swimming? No, I don't want realistic swimming. Why is not letting me? Oh, frig, man. I can't... How do I get down there? Yo, that's really fucking weird. Yo, there's something wrong with this game. Oh, I, I gotta tighten my headset. No, stop it. Okay. I might have to switch it over to realistic swimming. Oh, this just sucks, bro. Where's that box? No. No, damn it. Where's that box? Ah, fuck. I'm like hitting my table. Shit. Yo, I hate this. I have... Very limited room where I am, so I'm smacking in the shit. Okay, it's sort of working yet. Yeah. Nope, nope, nope. Bro. <laughs> this sucks. 
Where's that fucking lockbox? Come here, lockbox. Oh, I see it. Okay, I see it. All right, I'm gonna drown. Oh man, I'm almost there. No, it's hit. Put the fucking flames away, prick. Okay, almost there. Come on, grab it. Oh, almost there. Come on. No, damn it. <laughs> Stop. Stop it. Stop. Oh, oh, yes. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, yes. Okay, take all. Thank you. Oh my god. Holy shit. Uh, wait a minute. Okay, wait. Take it off, take it off, take it off. No, no, where is it? Realistic swimming. Alright, fuck off. Okay. I don't know. I guess the game considers that... The hell? That too shallow? To dive or something? That's never happened before. Oh, I'm probably like, screaming. Yo, this wire is like in the way. You know, I'm using... Friggin... Virtual desktop now, so I shouldn't... Dude. What the hell was that? I'm using virtual desktop now, so I actually I don't need the, the meta link cable. But the good thing about it is it's constantly charging my headset, so. Oh man, I should save it. No, save, because I'm not doing that shit again. I'm uh, making you save. All right, where is this asshole now? He's somewhere in there. Ooh. Magic mushroom. Gimme. I keep forgetting there's a lot of stuff in this game that you can get. A lot of shit's hidden. Yarrow's house. What the? Get up there. Oh. I think he's down here. Jasper the Molester, where are you at? I hope this is not the dungeon. Shit. Hey, where's my boat? Good crack pipe. Where's my bow? Oh, okay. They favorite that. Actually, you know what? No, no. Take that. Grab this. Put that on my back. Um. Where's the sword? Sword. Here we go. I don't have a crossbow yet, so I'll put this on my back. My right side. Got the sword. All right, beautiful. All right, let me sneak around. I don't know if that's Jasper or not. And that is a trap. And neither can I. Ooh, pennies. Gimme, gimme. Alright, I'll take that. Layered what? Coat? Alright, I'll take that too. Oh, I don't want to look at him. Might be naked. Oh, he's got clothes, okay. Phasmalist workbench? I don't 
hell's this shit? Uh, okay. Uh oh, that's a new spell tome. Nice. Heavy leather boots. Let me see this shit. What did I get? I'll take that. I'm wearing... Uh... Traveler gloves. Oh, that's right. Look at that. It's a mod I added. Ring, ring of extra carry. Nice. I could carry over 10,000 pounds worth of shit. What is this? Ring of the Light Mentor. Light magic spells. Well, I'm a cheater, so I actually have unlimited magic. But it doesn't matter because if I use it too much, I get sick, so there was no point in even adding it. Is that a knife? Iron dagger. Let me save it. Ectoplasm. So I'm just gonna friggin' grab anything and everything I can. Since I practically have unlimited shit anyways. Or, um... Unlimited... Uh, weight? Or encumbrance? Yo, he's this guy's kinda fast. Alright, that's a trap. I see that. Ooh, I see a mushroom. Empty bottle wine. Empty bottle wine. I can't speak right today. Is this a trap door? What is this? The lighting is like really good. Oh wow. Yo, pick it up, dude. Here we go. Heavy armor. I'll take that. Iron ore. sell that actually can I it's valued as 75 so well that is if I can actually get 75 coins for it I don't even know yeah that would have fucked me up I'll take that. Yeah, a lot of stuff that you find in this world is very valuable. It's not like Skyrim, where you could just practically just leave everything. This, anything you find in this game, like, you pretty much, it has some kind of use. Every dungeon has a lot of useful items. It's, um, it's pretty much strategically placed. Items and things scattered throughout the world is there for a reason. And I see another... What is that? A bear trap of some kind. I don't think I need the bottles. Bone meal. I don't think I really need that. Alright, let me... Let's see if I can offset this thing. Can I? Shit. Damn. Jasper, you fucking better be in there. Right, I'm gonna have to jump over it. Ha! Ha! Is it... Is that him? Dude, you better not fucking take a swing at me. Yeah, it is him. Holy shit. Well, if it isn't my new friend. Any luck? Yeah, I found what Yarrow tried to get rid of. Here, have a look. Interesting. 
I didn't know about his companion's fate, to be honest. Hmm. Irony of fate, isn't it? Murdered by those you wanted to help. But the Order will definitely be interested in these letters. Well done. That just leaves the old man in the village. I had a chat with this Alfred. It seems to think that... He seems to think that... Tell well, just, well. Oh, whatever. That's interesting. Good work. That should be all we need, then. Splendid. What about you? Did you find anything? I did, and now I finally know what to make of it. Come, follow me. Okay, let's go. Ooh, creep cluster. Is it? Grab it. Wait, do I have a torch? Oh, I do have a torch. Where'd this brick go? Oh, there you are. Hope he just waits there, because I'm gonna look around. Getting greedy. Ooh, potion. Take that. What's this? A wooden bowl. Ooh, pennies, pennies. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give Put that away. I don't think the torches are uh, unlimited, so. I have easy lock picking. What? Eterna ears. Whatever. Cheese. Alright. Plum and wheat. Oh, nice. Alright. Uh, read. You know what? I'm gonna sell these books. Petty Soul Gem. And what is this? A... Vin, a geographical overview. Right, I'll take it just in case. Got 10,000 pounds worth of weight anyway, so why not? I might as well. Ooh. Recipe. Chimicum swiftness. Increases your... Wait, what does this say? Re oh, it's a recipe. A recipe for chimicum swiftness. Thistle, small pearl, increases your movement speed in wolf form. Can only be used by lycanthropies. Or lycan lycanthropes. AKA werewolves. Got it. Light nasal helmet. You see the armor rating on this thing. Where is it? Oh, might as well wear it. As a matter of fact, you know what? Oh, no, no, no! Oh, man. I thought the game was gonna crash. Okay. Um. No. Mod configuration. I think with Vrick, it has the third per- Wait, where is it? Third person thing. Okay. No, where is it? No. I think it's Jester. Overview. I can see what I look like. No, where is the selfie mode? Maybe it's controls. Here it is. Alright. Show compass when left palm up. I gotta see that. I gotta try that. Hold on a sec. Uh, left palm up. Hello? No? Alright, selfie mode. Ah! There it. It's pretty much the same look. I present I... a star people's lock. And I bet my buttocks will find another answer behind that door over there. What you talking about, Willis? A star people's lock? I've never heard of that before. Doesn't surprise me. This kind of lock is usually only found in treasuries or castles. But they can be picked, though that's going to be quite the challenge without the bolts. 
I have easy lock picking. Do you need bolts to open them? Normally, yeah. It's quite simple, actually. Every keyhole has a matching bolt that latches into place once you insert it. And once all the keyholes, five in our case, are latched, the door the lock protects opens up. If you don't have the matching bolts, however, you should prepare yourself for the most frustrating break-in of your life. That is, if you don't happen to be Jaspar. Who knows a little trick? What kind of trick? You can use wooden sticks instead of bolts. They'll break a couple of seconds after you put them inside the lock, but if you manage to get all five sticks into place before the first one breaks, you can basically trick the mechanism. It's all about speed, in other words. So I'd say you do the running, and I'll wait near the pressure plate. You ready? Uh, hang on. What exactly do you need me to do? That was a little fast. You're right. Sorry. Yeah, I'm a little All slow. you have to do is insert one stick into each of the five keyholes as fast as possible. Oh, Once you've done that, I'll push the pressure plate, which will open the door. If you're too slow, we'll just have to try again. Alright then, let's do this. Alright then, let's do this. Keep your chin up. All right, let me... I present a star people's lock. And I bet my buttocks will find another answer behind that door over there. Wait, hold on, hold on. Keep your chin up. I no, present stop it, stop it, stop. a star oh, people's lock. No, 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 And I bet my buttocks will find another answer behind that door over there. Keep your chin up. I present yes, a I know. star okay, people's okay, lock. Doesn't okay. surprise me. Uh, this yes. kind of lock it. All Normally, right. yeah. If you don't have the matching bolts, however, you should prepare. You can use wooden sticks. And They'll break yeah, a couple of the, seconds after you put them inside. They're gonna force you so to. So I'd say much. you do the running and splendid. Oh, come on. All right, go. What? Huh? Huh? Do it again. Oh, shit. Keep your chin up. Uh-oh. I think I fucked up. I may have fucked up. Oh, that's what I get for, uh... Trying to look around for shit. And I'm doing it again. Yo, I might have to... Redo this segment. Oh, shit. I think I had to do it again. Keep your chin up. Oh, my God. I fucked up, man. I messed up. All right, I'm about to reload it. Oh, dude, really? Uh, okay, wait. Save that. I'm just gonna speed through. Oh, there's pennies here. I'm just gonna have to s speed through the friggin' dialogue. Now a good pipe. Shut up, Yarrow. Alright, that stupid mushroom. Ice claw. I don't know why they call them ice claw. Looks, looks like a fucking mushroom from Super Mario Brothers or something. Yeah, I do. Alright. 
jump over this. Well, if it isn't my new friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Interesting. But the order will... That just leaves the old man in the village. Uh-huh. Well, well. Blah, 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 blah. That should be all we need, then. Yep. Splendid. I did. And mm -hmm. now I finally know what to make of it. Okay. Come, on. follow me. Go on. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. I'm tempted to smack him in the head, but... I have a feeling he's gonna friggin' turn around and punch me in my head. Punch me in my face for that, so... And then I have to reload the friggin' thing again. Alright. I'll search after. I present a star people's lock. And I bet my buttocks will find another answer behind that door over there. Doesn't surprise me. This kind of locket, normally, yeah. if you don't have the matching bolts, however, you can use wooden sticks. They'll break a couple of seconds after. So I'd say you do the running, and I'll wait near the pressure plate. You ready? Splendid. Here are the sticks. All right, go! What am I supposed huh? to What? Oh, okay. I think... Where's the other one? Alright, I'm an idiot. I think I've seen... There's one... Ha! Ah. Damn, that was too slow. We'll try it again. Mm. Okay, do it again. Huh? Keep your chin up. What? Damn, that was too slow. We'll try it again. Dude. Really? Damn, that was too slow. We'll try it again. to get rid of some shit. Uh. I'm just gonna drop shit that I'm not using. Damn, that was too slow. Are you serious? We'll try it again. What the hell? Two. Yeah. Ah. Fuck you. Come on, come on. It's not. Dude, come on. Damn, that was too slow. We'll uh -huh. try it again. Yo, the interaction is not showing, like, fast enough, like... 
Oh my god. Alright, there's one, two. Three. Four. No, four or five. Okay. Um. Hmm. Let me think about this. I'm gonna have to maybe do this one first. This one, that one, the one all the way over straight across from me, and then the bottom two. One. Two. It's not showing. Bro. Three. It's not fucking showing, bro. Brilliant. Oh, fuck. I'm really good at this. Now let's take a look and see what no. the old magister didn't want anyone to see. Dude, shall I, we? I want to put an arrow in this motherfucker's head. Alright, save it. Now I want to go back and search for more shit, but. The fuck? Oh, shit. Wait, this is a flame. Way too easy. My health was low. Eat something. Okay. Oh, a fire elemental. Not a weak one. Yeah, I'm using a fire, uh, fire magic, elemental. Sure. Real, real smart. That leaves us with the question of what exactly this is supposed to be. A corpse? At the risk of blowing your mind, I had already figured as much. Hmm. I suppose that's his companion. Though it's interesting that he was already on the wrong side of the law way before his rampage. He was on the wrong side of the law? Why? Well, burials are considered heathen here in Enderal, and have been forbidden for about 300 years now. Here, Hurry up, corpses man. I gotta are always eat cremated. Bro. The whole thing's called the last journey. The deceased I'm, is taken to a place I'm he or die. she considered special during his or her life immediately after dying. That's the only way the soul can move on to the eternal paths. Sounds very poetic, but I'm pretty sure the only reason the Order introduced the law was to prevent plagues. Plus, they might have noticed that too many lost ones running around on trade routes aren't that much fun for wanderers and traveling merchants. So, burying someone like that is considered a crime? Yeah, but of course that only goes for the little man. The rich and powerful still tend to their family crypts. And there are still plenty of old vaults around from the time before this whole last journey thing was begun. And it's good that way. Oh, what those would life as a treasure um, hunter be like without the notorious nobles looking for family murals. jewels in a century old grave? Skyrim. Hmm, so what now? Hmm, so what now? Let's take a look around and see if we find anything. All right, I gotta eat something. Health. Antidote. No. Carrot. No, it's for stamina. And dryly and crusty bread. Oh. Learning book, one memory point. Okay. Man, a fungus. No. A plum. A stamina. Oh, whatever. Alright, pumpkin. Oh, wolf meat. Okay, here's my health. Yo, it's slowly regenerating. Yo, this game is friggin' hard, man. This is definitely not friggin' Skyrim. Fire assaults. Oh, that's... That's very endearing. What are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, 
Okay. Oh, Yarrow's memorial book. Beloved Sirrah. Ah, here you go. This is my last letter. In it, I ask for forgiveness, for it was I who murdered you. No, of course it wasn't me who See, I don't I'm knife, tempted to skip this and just take the book, but I don't want to mess anything up. Fallacy. The fallacy that the world wants to be saved. It doesn't. Yes, Sarah. There's still a part of me who refuses to believe these words even as I write them. But just one look is enough to prove me a fool. We have so much, yet we are never content. We could make peace, yet we choose war. We embrace hatred over love. Can you please hurry up? Oh, he's got to read all these pages, too? Oh, my God. Silver lining. No matter how much we try to tell ourselves the opposite, mankind is at its end. It has been since some mad god created it for his amusement. A Quaranian philosopher once said, Mad God. Huh. There comes a time in our he makes really good models. We make a choice. A choice to live virtuously, yet His flowers look nice. Austerity, or ignobly, yet in pleasure. The philosopher called this second choice choosing the void, because this is what lurks behind its pretty face. Do you see it now, Sira? The bitter truth? They all chose the void, all but us. We who dreamed of something bigger. We who were willing to make a sacrifice for the greater good. Can you please read just, just a little bit faster? We could have done if we hadn't been alone. But we were alone from the very beginning. And no, Syrah, these words do not come easy. You of all people should know that. I wanted to believe there was hope. I wanted to believe that all one has to do is remain strong. But look where our idealism brought us. Here I am. In front of your dead body murdered by those you wanted to help we should have fled fled to a far away mm -hmm. isle nice guys finished last but we didn't and why because i corrupt oh yeah my this is totally the skyrim dragon mural yeah, there it is i don't think there is life after same uh same asset not care but before i make my exit Give this and that corpse there looks service. like something from the uh, you remember? the they Dark Brotherhood. The like that, remember? There's like a door or something have it. to their hideout. Oh, I forgot the name of it. Are we done? What's that? Let me see. Uh huh. A tragic ending for a tragic personality, I'd say. Okay, I well, can't get up. I think that should suffice. I can't. I can't see. Well, what should I think about it? Yarrow was a self-righteous fool, just like all these do-gooders are. They celebrate themselves as great messiahs as long as everything goes well, but once they fail, it's the bad, bad world that's responsible for it. The wise hermit has a good saying for that. People are only idealists until it starts to hurt. He and his lady should have simply stayed in Riverville. Dude, I can't see this. Glad you see it that way. What? Yeah, we are. Here, we've got two teleport scrolls that can take us right back to Riverville. Just meet me in the tavern once you're ready to go. I have some stuff to take care of, so there's no need to hurry. Farewell. Oh, nice. Dude, that was freaking cool. I want to do that. Oh. Nice. She's uh, definitely seen better days. Is that a chick? It's a dead chick. Yo, this corpse... This corpse kind of... 
You could tell she had nice tits when she was on. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get canceled for that shit. Let me see something here. <laughs> yeah, I get to <laughs> She totally did. I can put my finger in her mouth. Boop, do brush. Boop. Uh, God, no wonder I have no friends. All right. I shall head back. But I want to come back here. Oh. So I can loot the rest of the stuff. I don't really need that shit. The boots. Well, I could sell them, I think. But. Oh, I don't know. Okay, here's a book. Take that. No, I should take it. Sell it. Give me. Uh, potion of magic. Protection. Okay. Forgot that you can grab stuff and just put it over your shoulder to collect it. Helmet. Recipe. Ah. Uh, read it. Take that, take that, take the pennies, take that, read that, take that. Let's see what else we got here. I think that is it. Is it? Yeah, that's it. You know what? Fuck it. I'll just take the boots back. Hope I can sell it. See, there's anything in the bowl? No. And there is a trap here. Ah, oh, how about this? All right, I'm out of here. I think that's it. Oh, oh, get it. Yo, I'll be damned if I, I kill if I get killed by a fucking rat. Where's the other one? Where? Oh shit! I can't see. There's the other one. Cheese wheels. Is that for health? All right, fuck it. Moldy cheese. Yummy. Hey, little buddy. Staff. Footprints of the what? No, oh, whatever. I need every friggin' penny I can get. Coal. Spoiled cheese, yum. Very appetizing. All right, I'll take all that shit. Garlic, is that garlic?
Yeah, it is garlic. Gimme! This. Oh, it's mead. Stamina generation. Regeneration. Just. Yeah. Alright. That is it. Oh, almost missed this. Block 7% more damage with your shield. And there's a Garnet. I can sell that. Alright, I can't see shit. Nice. Yeah, everything, like I said earlier, everything you find in this game has some kind of value. Alright, sir. This is a blueprint. Leather curious. Even these little bastards. Rat meat. Ugh. I don't want to eat it. Oh, book. Ah, oh, fuck it. I'll take everything. All right. I think that's it. Oh, nice. Two moons. That's pretty cool. You can see these stars are freaking sparkling as well. That's nice. Should get rid of this stupid icon. Alright, uh. I have to. Where? Meet Jesper. Where? In Riverville. Wait, where am I? Okay, there I am. Alright, straight forward this way. It's not that far. Oh, is that a eagle? Cool. Who's that? Oh, he's gonna attack me, isn't he? Yep. That oh, fuck. God. Die. 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 What is this? Are you drunk? Come no. on, you can do better. Oh, bitch. Come here, bitch. Don't fucking run. You wanna talk smack? Oh, the fucking crab wants to kill me, too. Holy shit. Ooh, crabby. Gimme. This bitch was talking shit. Alright. Take her boots. Yo, I'm just gonna sell everything, man. Fuck it. Iron cutlass. I'll take that. Is she naked? And she's burned. Fuck, who was that? Oh. Alright, 
I gotta watch my magic use because I'm gonna get that sickness. Wolf claws, wolf meat. Take the pelt. Come here, doggy. Okay, that's that shit talker. Alright, where's this? Alright, another shit talker right here. Ooh, taking everything. Iron Waka Wakizashi. I think I have that already. You burn your ass. Since you like the fucking. This is what you get from run running your fucking mouth, bro. I wonder if he's gonna burn. He is kinda, isn't he? Dude, that is freaking so cool. Yo! The freaking effects in this game are freaking awesome. Very realistic. sleep. Yo, there's a lot of shit here, man. Like I said, every single area with items has, like, some kind of value to it. Oh, this is really cool. I like the, the effects in this. It's, like, moving. I think it's, I think these are called animated potions, if I'm not mistaken. Let's say diluted magic or renewal something. Oh, what? Oh, fucking tracking, man. Okay. Yeah, the tracking is not very good. It's supposed to be better than the quest 2. Alright, good. But I think it's because when the room is dark or when you're in a low light area. It doesn't track as well because of the, there's cameras on each side of the headset. All right, where is this town? I think it's up that in that direction. Is that a dog? Oh, are you waiting for me? Nah, I'll leave him alone. Killed his family. Uh, okay. Oh, it's an urn root. And I see some mana. Oh, that's a hanging body. Get up there. Take that. And that. Where is... Let me get a better view from up here. Get up there. Yo, I, I wonder, can I wait? No. Oh, there is no waiting. Yeah, this ain't like Skyrim. Dude, where is this freaking town? If I can't find it normally, I'm just gonna freaking fast travel, man. Ooh, I see a magic mushroom. I got a little ways to go. Yeah, I'm just gonna fast travel. I'm too lazy. But, let me just get that mushroom first. Cause there's- Oh shit. Oops. Cause there's nothing like getting high on shrooms. On digital blue shrooms. There it is. Alright. Alright, I gotta watch myself because this game has fall damage. Can I make it down there? I hope I can. Yeah. Where's my house? I think that's my home. Wait. Is that my home? Right here? 
Whoa. Yeah, I get yeah, okay, this is my home. I'm gonna rest. Because I can't see shit. Alright. Well, six hours is good. Alright. I'm gonna save it here. Alright, I think that's gonna be about it. I've been playing for long enough, and I'm sure whoever's watching this, I doubt anybody's watching this. <laughs> so I'm not getting shit. I'm not getting any kind of views anymore. Uh, yeah, YouTube is penalizing me once again. Well, then again, they've always been penalizing me. But yeah, they really, really cut down on my views this time. I went from at least hundreds of views to maybe 1,000, 2,000 views. It got better. It was getting better. Now, I'm, I can't even get 30, 40 views. So I... I did something along the way to piss YouTube off again, and they are basically giving me the digital middle finger. So, I don't know. I think I have to be good for a while and uh, keep away from the stupid memes. They're getting old and boring anyways, and I can't even use the memes now because uh, they're all gone completely. Every single meme that I've ever collected over the years is completely gone. No more movie clips, nothing. So, uh, at, you know, since I'm getting shadow banned uh, there's no point in getting the memes back or redoing it because I have to go so many places to find them and uh, it's just not worth it so I'm just gonna it's gonna be meme free for for a long time and yeah I'm, I'm just gonna try my best to keep the the cursing down to a minimum which is very hard because I curse like a freaking sailor so yeah all right hope you enjoyed the video if anybody's watching this video I hope you enjoyed the video and not only subscribe to my channel but um, tell people about me. get the word out that I have a channel. That, that share share my channel because at this point I, I I need all the help I can get. All right, so yeah, I'll see y'all later on. And uh, if anybody has any suggestions or any uh, particular ideas, or if they want to see any particular videos in virtual reality or even flat screen games. I play pretty much all kinds of genres. Not really great at the horror stuff, but you know what, for the views, I am willing to do it. Uh, horror games really creep me out. The last one I purchased actually was a game called uh, Madison. And man, the game looks beautiful, beautiful. Especially for a creepy, creepy game in some kind of old dilapidated home. But yeah, it's like Visage, man, but on steroids. It's got that Resident Evil 7 Visage look, and it just, it, I was blown away, blown away when I saw it in VR, especially with the virtual desktop. Virtual desktop is like my go-to, the way to play virtual reality games, by the way. I did not believe it before when I heard it, and I thought, it was like, ah, it can't be all that good because it's not wired, but I, it's, it's even better than wired. I don't know how they're doing it. Uh, I don't. What I have no idea what the dev did, the developer of Virtual Desktop did. But wow, definitely uh, props to him. Props, props to that dude. So yeah. All right, I'm gonna stop rambling and I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to edit this video somehow and upload it. And it's in 4K, so it's gonna, it's gonna take a while. So from the time you're watching this, if anybody's watching this, you're not going to see the video for, I don't know, two days. Two days from now. All right. So, yeah, I'm out of here. Good night, everybody. And I'll see you when I see you. Oops. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.